Nasunugan ka na ba? Takot kang maulit ito. Eh di kumuha ka ng fire extinguisher. Pero paano kung wala kang fire extinguisher? Pero paano kung wala ka ng pera at agpupugrot na katulad ko? Halika Halik kayo! May experiment tayo para dyan! Tara, mag-interview muna tayo. Ma'am, ano pong reaksyon nyo pag nasunuan kayo ng bahay? Ano? Nasusunog bahay namin? Ano pong reaksyon nyo pag nasunuan kayo ng bahay? Siyempre, masyasyak ka. Tapos, malulungkot. Hello, ma'am. Ano pong reaksyon nyo pag nasunuan kayo ng bahay? Siyempre, magugulat ka. Ah. Kasi ang dami-daming mga kagamitan sa loob ng bahay. Thank you po. Ayon sa aming interview, natural na maraming malulungkot at magugulat kapag may nasunugan. Kaya tara na, ito na ang solusyon kung wala kang pera. The first material that we need here is the graduated cylinder. Next is we have the baking soda. Any kind of plastic bottle. And we have the funnel or in Tagalog we call it in budo. Any brand of white vinegar. Petri dish or if you don't have it, you could use some container. Candle and match. And lastly, we have the balloon and the beaker. The first step that we need to do is put the baking soda into the bottle using the funnel so it doesn't spill. After we put the baking soda into the bottle, the next step that we need to do is put the white vinegar into the bottle. Put the balloon in the rim of it. When the baking soda is mixed with the vinegar, it creates carbon dioxide bubble gas. And then, it captured by the balloon. Release CO2 into a graduated cylinder and pour it over the candle. Carbon dioxide has ability to suffocate a flame. That's why the flame in the candle went out. There you go! A DIY fire extinguisher! I hope you guys enjoyed this video! Bye! Hello, what's the